All right, here's a realistic question. Uh, if you have, if you want to retire in 30 years and during your retirement, you want to withdraw $50,000 per year for 20 years, how much do you need to put away at the end of each year um, if you're going to get a 3% interest rate for the rest of your life um, so that you can do this, so that you can pull out $50,000 per year during your retirement? All right, so first of all, we need to find out the first step. Uh, we need to find out how much money you're going to need at the beginning of your retirement so that you can make this happen. So we'll, we'll, we will use the present value of an annuity formula, which is PV is equal to A times 1 minus uh, 1 plus I to the negative N all over I. Now we've been talking about what all this means in the last couple of videos. We have present value. So this is how much we're going to need to have at the beginning of retirement. This is how much you know we're withdrawing each year, 3% interest rate, and, and for retirement, we plan on being retired for 20 years, so that will be a 20. So if we go and fill this out, we will have present value is equal to 50,000 times, um, we will have 1 minus <clears throat> 1 plus, 0 0.03 to the negative 20 all over 0 0.03. Um, we can simplify this uh, a little bit more. Let's say this was 50,000. Uh, that was a 0 times. Well, this will become 1 minus 1 1.03 to the minus 20. Uh, to the minus 20 all over 0 0.03. That's a 20. Uh, and so if you go ahead and you calculate the rest of this, uh, there's no sense in simplifying it any further by hand. If you go and calculate this in your calculator, you will find that the present value uh, is going to equal 743,873 dollars and 74 cents. Okay, so what is this value? This is the amount of money that you're going to need in your bank account pretty much the day that you retire so that you can withdraw fifty thousand dollars per year for twenty years providing that you're still making a three percent interest rate on this investment okay so now the rest of the question is saying well how much are we gonna have to start putting away now at the end of each year you know for the next thirty years uh... in order to get this much money so let's say let's guess let's change colors uh... now to do this uh, we're going to need to use the future value of an annuity formula. So we will have FV is equal to A times 1 plus I um, all to the power of N minus 1 over I. Again, now we have the future value. Uh, well, that will be this value. Now the future value of our investments is going to be you know, the present value of our withdrawals. So. And I think the easiest thing to do is actually just to fill out uh, these values. So we will write future value is now going to be seven thousand or seven hundred and forty three thousand, sorry, eight seventy three point seven four is equal to A. This is going to be our annual investments or annuity that we're investing uh, times well, 1 plus 0 0.3, we can just skip that one step and just write 1.03 um, to the power of n. Now, n is going to be 30 years in this case. You'll notice that, you know, now we're looking at a 30-year time period where we're investing money, not that 20. That 20 years is kind of irrelevant now. That was for this, the first part of the problem. So, we have 1.03 to the power of 30 minus 1 over 0 0.03. Three. Okay, so um, if you just uh, punch this in your calculator, and we only have one variable here, so obviously if you just want to solve for A, we're going to find out that A, our annuity, is going to equal 15,635 dollars and 68 cents. So this month, this number here, fifteen thousand dollars. This is how much you're going to need to put away at the end of each year for thirty years, uh, with the given interest rates, so that once you retire, you can withdraw fifty thousand dollars every year for twenty years of retirement.